And God said, let the video start. <laughs> uh, <laughs> hey guys, <laughs> welcome back to Feed the Beast, take five. Um, today, uh, we've we've made, or oh, I've made a bit of an upgrade to the mob farm. Uh, we have Fred the Turtle down here. Fred. Fred. This is the script I'm using, it basically says, uh, attack a thousand times, then go through and drop everything uh, below it, because we've got, we've got too much junk here. And like, all of the armor as well. <laughs> got we too much jump there. So, uh, if I just start this up, boop! And, uh, it works really well. Uh, before we had the turtle, um, we just kept punching, and it was too much effort, wasn't it? It was quite a lot of effort, yeah. And it took about ten minutes. For some reason with the turtle, it takes about five minutes. But I found something new. So I'm gonna terminate him. Ooh, That's something. okay, Fred, you'll get your moment again in a minute. Oh, do you want your enchant book back? No, this is my enchant book. I already gave you yours back. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, I'm going to make another turtle quickly. Um, ba -bum, ba -bum. And craft it with a sword to make a melee turtle. And then, craft it with an enchanting table. Dun, dun, dun. Have a look at that. XP. Whoa. It is awesome. Now, give it back. Give it back. <laughs> Give it back. Thank you. So I'm going to put him at the back there. And uh, there's a script I found online. So hang on. Now let me remember. It's get paste bin one uh, z f five x i five n. And I'll call it startup. No such program. Woohoo! Hang on. Edit. Start up. Maybe you have to do it like. Wait, no, hang on, I remember. Derp. It's a paste bin. Get no, don't do that. <laughs> paste bin. Get one z f five x i five n. Start up. Oh. Oh. Success. Now this is an incredibly awesome um, script which someone has written, and it's it's amazing. If I just start up, check that out. What? Okay, first of all, I'm gonna I'm gonna just re-enable Fred down here. And now now watch. Look, click back in into into the new new Fred. I have three levels of experience. It sucks up all the experience, and you can use it to enchant stuff. That's mad. It's amazing. It goes up to like level 500 as well. So can we just like leave this on all the time now? Uh, if we had a chunk loader, yeah, but um, it would probably, probably kill the server with a lot of entities. <laughs> we don't like lots of entities, do we, Quinn? <laughs> Let me... Killed the server last time. And yeah, uh, Quinn. Just spent... <laughs> Yeah, I'm fixing it. <laughs> um, I'm still not sure. I guess it, it's fine at the back there. But yeah, it goes and sucks up all the XP. Could we not put like a panel like you do for the bottom one? Yeah, but you need to right click him to access him. Um, you can, you we, can... could, we could get rid of that chest. Yeah, we don't. I suppose we don't really need the potions now anymore, do we? No. We'll just. Sweet. Hang on, just quickly, I wanna uh, terminate. No, I don't want. Yeah, I do. Set label. Um, um, exterior. Whoops. Label set. Exterior. Delta the boo boo. At least, at least I didn't get it wrong, and then I had to ask you like a thousand times. Mm. Likes. So, so like I put a book in there, and it yeah, it's a, you 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 put a book in slot sixteen. What's that bottom right? Then? Bottom right. Let's you see. got a book. I can get your book. <laughs> well, we could wait for it to get up to level thirty. I'll tell you what, we'll we'll cut back to when it has thirty levels. <laughs> 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 that that looked painful. I have book. 
I have book. Okay, so it's been about three minutes. <coughs> and um yeah, with good old Xperior here, he's got thirty two levels of experience now, so if you whack a book in the sixteenth slot Book. Okay, what do I do now? I don't know, why is it not doing anything? Um right, so I think we press one first for enchanting. And then we need to enter how many levels we actually want to enchant the book to. And we're just going to go for 30. Yes. Press enter. Oh, oh damn, damn, that's sexy. What'd sharpness you get? Three. Sharpness 3. So I've got another Sharpness so 3. pretty cool. Man. So, oh. yeah, we we can now add that to our selection of Sharpness 3 Dale. books. Dale. I, have a, I have a gift. <gasps> uh, now we can add more enchanted books. Oh, yeah, I upgraded our vile sword to uh, Soul Stealer 5. Dang, girl. So we can now get six souls for every kill. Right. So that's the first part of this video. Now there is something even cooler I want to show you in this video. Even cooler. So let's go Let's go back to our power station plant thing. Pong. Pong. So um, I don't know if you know this, Alex, but you know how crap Zycorium is? Yes. It's not that crap. Um, well... The whole mod, actually, because there's a there's a block I found, which is really cool, and I need some glass for this. That sandstone glass. Um, yeah, stack will do. Stack will do. Are you following? Yeah. Yeah, I'm following. Do 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 do. Okay, project table. Check this out. This is part of the Zycorium mod or XY craft. Do that. Dang. Nope. Put some iron in the middle, you get glass viewer. What? <laughs> now, this is a really cool block. It's basically the exact same as glass, but over here. Oh. No. Don't tell me. Oh. I know where this is going. Really? I think so. Oh. Maybe. Hang on, that's rather tough to break. That's okay. Do you have silk touch on your drill? Not yet, no. Oh, okay. But yeah, that's kind of cool. I like how the textures are uh, combined. <sighs> okay, so where does Zycorium come into this? Zycor I'll get to that once I've... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Five hours later. <laughs> I know I'm going to rip through the sand after that as well. Yeah, there we go. For some reason, my, my frame rate dropped to 12 frames per second while I was destroying that. Okay, so here's where Zycorium comes into use. Think Furnace, think. yeah. Okay. Smelt Zycorium. You get Zycorodite. Okay. Okay. <coughs> Project table. Uh, 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 uh. Uh, 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 uh. Oh. Nope. <laughs> Hang on. I always get things messed up like that. Cock. What? What? Uno momento. Uno momento. Oh, okay. I see why I got it wrong. Bonk. Oh, crapper. <laughs> there we go. Blue engineering brick. Oh, goodness. Now, this is where I needed the iron bars. I remember now. You put those in a square like that. And then you do that. And you put a bucket in the middle, you get a valve. Oh, okay, this wasn't going where I thought it was going. Oh, it wasn't? Now, you can... I'm just going to use marble because this is cool. Okay, you can... You can. This is this is where things get really cool. Okay. Okay. Oh, hang on, let me just... I'm just trying to do this off the ground a bit, just so I can... Yeah, just like that. Put that back. Give that back. Ain't nobody got time for that. What you talking about, Willis? <laughs> Actually, we'll leave that one there like that. Look, four corners in like that. I'm you intrigued. Oh, wow. For some reason, I get a really low frame rate here. Uh, I don't know why. Hang on. No, I'm cool. F3. 
There's not a load of entities. Hang on, let me just stop recording a second. <laughs> okay, back. Don't know what, what's wrong, but it's fine. Uh, because I'm OCD, I'm going to have to take that out. Put that there. Uh, haha. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh, Do you, oh. Are you following yet? Oh, sorry, I was elsewhere. Do you know what? what do you know? Don't don't worry. It's just random blocks. It's just oh. showcasing that you can do this with pretty much any block. Okay. And then we can use our glass view. You don't have to use glass viewers either. You can use any block. You just thought glass viewers. I just thought glass say. viewers look cool because it's like seamless. It looks a lot better than the the normal vanilla glass. IMO. So let's take well, it's that kind one of out. like opt if you, do you yeah see optifine like, glass optifine glass that's pretty cool but it's got less of the uh, the white lines as well okay yeah. do you know what we have here Alex we're gonna have a tank it's raining it's a tank oh good oh Goodness. hello I right clicked on it with some some uh, some sugar cane that's gone funky it's like Tron has it has it is it all rendering for you it's got blue lines all over it. Yeah, but it. is this side actually here for you? <laughs> Half of it is missing for me. No, it's there. Okay, hang on one sec. Let me reload. Okay, it's back. <laughs> so yeah, this is really cool. It's like the iron tank, but it's got a lot less restrictions. First of all, it can be made out of any hard material, so it can't be made out of sand or dirt. Uh, second of all, it doesn't have to be, you know how this one has to be a perfect square at the bottom, it has to be only odd numbers, and it's got a height restriction. That can be like, could you make it an L shape? I don't think so, I think it has to be a cuboid, but the maximum size it goes up to is, I think, 12 by 12 by 12. So in reality, we could have made our fuel tanks out of that. Yep, and we could have saved a crap ton of iron. And the best thing is, you can share walls with this as well, so I can build another tank like... Oops, not like that. I can build another tank like this. And if you have the valve in the middle, it will automatically... I don't have enough material to finish making that tank. But if the valve yep. is in the middle, it will automatically share the amount uh, the, the fluid between the two tanks. Ba, 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 ba. Which is really cool. And I like the Tron effect. I really do not know why I'm getting such bad frame rate. Let me sleep. This is. Hang on. Let me just get to my bedroom. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and now suddenly I've my frame rate's up to thirty frames a second again. I don't understand this. Well, the rain will go away now. Oops, and that makes everyone happy. Rain, rain, go to away, go to away. So, so. so so I'm so thinking could, we could we could you can technically link up four of these tanks in a square like a 12 by 12 tank twank next to another 12 by 12 twank next to another 12 by 12 twank and another 12 by 12 twank and they would all swear the same inventory basically <laughs> My name's David Oh no um, bam, ba -da, ba -ba -ba -da. By the way, did you see this? See what? What the hell is that? That's what I made last episode, which you haven't seen yet because it's still not up. What is that? <laughs> Hang on, no, follow me, follow me. Where are you? Here I am. Okay, so... Yeah? Yeah. Now, I wonder if this will work for you. Listen. No, I can only hear that through your microphone. Oh, okay. Well. <laughs> and the other thing, it's a wrench as well. <laughs> so what, what's that? What is that? An advanced something? It's gravito. Gravito. Just be careful when you go to charge it up, though, because if you right-click the MFSU when it's in wrench mode, you'll change it, because it works like a industrial craft wrench. Oh, right. So uh, switch tools or change modes or whatever. But yeah, I think I think this Sycorium tank thing 
it's going to be pretty cool to make uh, different tanks for for our power plant station. And I hope we can stick some of these tank blocks or uncraft them and get all that iron back. That's what I was just looking into. I was just looking if you can like smelt them down or... Hang on, we can check in any eye, can't we? That's iron true. tank, iron tank cover, iron tank something. Iron tank valve. I've got iron tank wall. Blast furnace. You oh, get steel. We have one of them. You get one steel ingot. <laughs> Um, that's a kind of a rip off. Um, um, hang on, what am I? I'm, I'm in an R in. Uh, uh, um, uh, uh, um, um, oh wow! You, I didn't know you can attach a mining laser to a turtle. What? <laughs> you can <laughs> attach a mining laser and a wand as well. Oh dear. This does not sound good. And what about the iron tank wall? Well, that goes in just... steel as well. So we can turn all of this into steel, I guess, if we need steel. I mean, at least it's better than doing nothing. But I think that's what we're going to do sort of off camera. I think we're going to convert that into a Zycraft tank. Well, do we really need to, though? Yes. It's... Why? Because I said so. Yeah, because, but because we might we... lose it all by some freak accident. Yeah, I'll experiment to how the tank keeps its inventory, because I know it does, I'm just not entirely sure. But uh, those are the two things I wanted to show everyone today. The uh, the new XP turtle farm thing, which I really don't know how... I, I'm sure that's not how it's meant to work. I'll look it up. But, I mean, it works just fine. I've come to the conclusion, Dale... Mm -hmm. that turning this iron into steel will be useless. Why? It uses a whole piece of coke coal just for an iron tank wall. For one steel ingot. That's like... Yeah, but it it it, it, it takes a steel ingot to... A uh, steel ingot? Uh, a whole coke coal for a steel ingot anyway. Like, regardless of what you put in it. I guess. Well, we've still got, like, two stacks of iron wall in this... Uh, chest over here and other yeah crap. well i don't know i just thought it would be cool you know it's it's it it, it it definitely adds more sort of variation and i like the way how it shares inventories and there's other add-ons you can add to it as well which you know our whole fuel transportation thing yeah yeah we could have done that so much easier with this <laughs> but but, 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 I think that'll do for today's episode. I've got, I haven't got a clue how long this is. I mean, with it's, all of our fails and derps and herps and... It'll probably be about five minutes by the time you've edited it all together. <laughs> I don't think so. Um, so our I think we'll... Huh? And next episode, Dale, you're going to work on your tower, aren't you? I'm going to work on that off camera and show progress, because I know building a big rectangle isn't that interesting. Yay, for big rectangles. Yeah, like yours. Mine is a fat rectangle, that's what it is. That is, it's a really fat rectangle. Fat By the way, a creeper blew me up in my corridor. What? A creeper blew, blew me up, like, right here. I fixed it, it's all fixed. All the wiring's done as everything as well, it's fine. Pipe is good, pipe is good. So, about seventh time, how did you get down there? I have access hole up here. Oh! Access. Access hole. In your basement, which I built for you. Thank you. <laughs> I needed the dirt. Anyway, yeah, I'm going to end this video now. So thanks for watching. Next time we'll do some fun stuff. I'm sure. <laughs> okay, see you guys next time. Say bye, Alex. Bye. Okay, recording. Go. <laughs> Great timing, that was, oh, that was wonderful. Oh, I'm just recording anyway. I can cut it in Vegas, it's easy. Do some outtakes. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously, is there not, can you not fix it with duct tape or something? Oh, it's, it's like a... Just can you not go get the task thing? Cough.
slammed it on the table. It seems to have fixed it. Okay. You, yeah, you, you can go when you want. <laughs> okay. Okay, I'm recording. Hello? Hello? Am I good? Yes. Okay, you ready? Yes. <laughs> now speak a sec. <laughs> Why? Uh, Skype's just done a little poop, but it's fine. Poop. Poop. <laughs> you ready? Yes.